I like to jam old, a lot of old school music, so that shit from the 99, 2000, all that extra shit, you know what I'm saying? And then my music always slowed down. I slowed up, but now I'm like a music connoisseur, so I listen to all music. And if I really like the song, I got to hear it slowed down. And that's in any genre of music. Like, it could be a rock song. I got to hear that bit slowed down. You know what I'm saying? So like, yeah. So them my 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 main influences though was Gucci, Boosie, Lil Wayne. Um, I could say Walker at one point because yeah, yeah. I was going hard in the motherfucking paint. Well, oh nine two thousand ten. Well, yeah. Hard, bro. I was going hard. And um, Shawty Low. Mm. Shotty Low, like was like I, I went to I went to school with one of Shotty Low's sons. Like we went to Benjamin Banneka High School together. This was twenty this two thousand nine. I had just touched high school. Feel me? And I had left Florida and went to and went to Georgia and I went to school with Shotty Low's son. And we played football together. And I, I remember, I ain't believe that he was Charlotte's son. Oh, he ain't Charlotte's son. Dun 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 That's your daddy? Nah. You feel me? That motherfucker pulled his phone out. He's like, if this ain't my, if that ain't my daddy, why I got all these pictures with him? Look, 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 look. This our TV right here. I'm like, oh shit. Man, that's Charlotte's son. <laughs> you feel me? And then uh, I remember he came up there with some uh, Charlotte Little mixtapes because Charlotte had just dropped mixtape and shit. Gave us one of them bitches and had all, like all them, all them hard ass songs that's like legendary right now, you feel me? Like they had just came out back then, you feel me? And shit, I always like, I'm like, bro, I'm a rap. I'm a rap, I'm a rap, I'm a rap. I'm a rap. Even in Atlanta, I was trying to rap. Cause like I couldn't get, couldn't get to no studios. It's just young, I ain't, ain't got no reach at all. Still a kid type shit. That's it. It was harder back then to get to a studio. I tell to a lot of artists, it's like back then you had to know somebody. Now you can just get a couple of dollars and buy a little studio, a little USB mic or something, plug you it up and get the Google and, and, and say studio. <laughs> and it's gonna pull up everybody who got a studio or right Or you can just, Use an app on your phone. Use an app on your Niggas phone. Niggas ain't now. had no apps to get on the phone back then. Now, like that's that, what's crazy now, bro. Like, I just seen one of my homeboys, I ain't gonna say his name, but he locked up right now. That nigga just dropped the mixtape. I said, nigga, <laughs> I got to salute you on that one, bro. How you just, you buy, and his shit sound like he out here recording. Exactly, bro. He ain't now, bro. Talent behind that wall, they, they keep they boy. I don't even want to talk about that, man. They 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 just they throw us away, man, and it's fucked up, bro.